As the planet cooled and the water evaporated, any bodies of water would have found themselves becoming more and more salty, as any salt concentration would have ended up with a lower and lower ratio of water. Again, too much salt is bad for most forms of life, and research suggests it could have been a massive hurdle for the survival of undeveloped protocells. Such cells simply may not have developed the tools to allow them to survive in such conditions. Even more developed Earth life would have struggled when combined with the depleting atmosphere and deadly radiation. So it's safer to search where life would have begun rather than places it would have distributed. Thus, volcanic spring sites like Columbia Hills already seem like a better place to look for signs of early life than Yezero Crater. If life never made it out of the primordial soup on Mars, those initial pools are the places that make the most sense to look, as so far, we're not looking there. <laughs>